Oh, that's better. It's raining, but I'm dry. It's raining, but I'm dry, sort of. I got wet. I'm covered now, but I'm still wet. I'm covered so that whatever else comes, I don't get soaked. Unlike my wife who was fighting with the hose. I'm covered with this umbrella. And as I, Bethany, my daughter, got an umbrella free in the mail today from her work with Pampered Chef. And it made me think about this, this illustration we have for today. Reminding us what it says in Psalm 32. Blessed are those whose lawless deeds are covered. Blessed is the man who's against whom the Lord does not count his sin. Sorry, I can't read in the rain, apparently. Reminded that, yes, we are all sinners. Yes, we are all, every one of us, deserving of God's condemnation. But we hear in Romans chapter C, chapter 3, Therefore, since we have been justified by faith, we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ, through whom we have obtained access by faith into this grace in which we now stand. This grace covers us. I've used for years the phrase umbrella of grace to remind us that as we have been given faith, as we've talked about in the past few days, that we are covered by God. We are right now in a world that is kind of a mess. We are looking for ways to keep the germs at a distance, to keep everything else from getting to us, because we don't want to get sick. We tell people to get away, we have our six feet separation kind of thing. We want to be covered. We want to have the gloves, the masks, everything else so that we don't get what that person has, the person that can't breathe very well. So we are experiencing a clawing, in a sense, for the proper covering in light of the current health situation around the world reminding us again what it says for all have sinned all need to be cleaned up and we all fall short of the glory of God but we are justified by his grace as a gift because Jesus paid the price in the next weeks perhaps months we don't know you're going to be challenged, each one of us, in varying degrees, I'm sure, to deal with a variety of situations that you really maybe aren't even fully equipped to deal with. But there they are. <coughs> That's just a tickle. That's no big deal. I just swallowed my rain too long, too hard. We aren't equipped to deal with all of the things in life. So too, we are not equipped to deal with sin. I can scrounge all day long. I can find whatever I can try to find to cover myself. But this umbrella is designed for that purpose, to cover. Yes, I'm sitting on a busy street. You probably can tell that. Umbrella is designed to cover. So is God's grace. So is God's love. Designed to cover my sin, to cover your sin. Do we also hear in Peter, the end of all things is at hand, therefore be self-controlled, be sober-minded for the sake of your prayers. Above all, keep loving one another earnestly since love covers a multitude of sin. Love covers. Those annoying people that are buying up those cases and cases of toilet paper and, and flour and bread and the things that you need in your homes. <coughs> those people that have been a real bother. Those people that you want to say, just get away from me. 
don't ever talk to me again, and so on and so forth. It says love covers their offenses too. And so realize that person you meet, that person who bothers you, as they are in Christ, they are covered. <coughs> they have that umbrella. You don't see their sin to be see them through Jesus. God doesn't see their sins. God doesn't see your sins. On the count of three, I want you to see if you can see me. Ready? One, two, three. You can't see me. You know I'm here. You can tell by my annoying voice. But you can't see me because... I'm covered. So too are you covered. May you live your lives starting today, going forward through these next days, weeks, whatever long, months even if it takes that, remembering you are covered in Christ's righteousness. You are covered in God's grace, blessed is the man who is covered because things come. Things come that bother. Sin is in the world. We are surrounded by sin. We are going to have to deal with sin every single day of our lives. Even if we are trapped in a bubble somewhere by ourselves, we have to deal with our own sin. Sin is what it is. Sin is always there. Sin bothers. Sin annoys. Sin kills. But we are covered in God's grace. May that be the joy that you have each day. Let's pray. Gracious Lord, cover us. Carry us. Embrace us in these difficult days. Remind us that no matter what rains down on us, that we are yours, we are yours eternally, we are yours in Jesus Christ. Amen.